<clears throat> Hello everyone and welcome back to my Let's Play series and I haven't come up with a name with yet. It's about, I'm sorry if yesterday when you saw my video about the uh, well not yesterday. I don't know when I'm posting this video. But if you saw my video last your day, I'm sorry I put that title. That was not a good title. I am really sorry. I'm going to go change that eventually. But I will show you how to make an enchantment room right now. They're very important. I've been working pretty hard. Dang it. That sucks. Alright. Over here. This is what a... This is our modern enchantment table that you saw in the Let's Play video yesterday. So, in the Minecraft... Oh my goodness, this is loud. Alright. In Minecraft, you have an enchantment table. And what many people could know, but... You have to have a certain amount of tape of bookshelves to actually use an enchantment table with level 30 enchantments. So, right here you have this isn't a full one, but see these last two slots here here? Well I can't these two? So you need a total of wait. Sorry, I'm not good at math this sometimes. 36 bookshelves in total to make a thir level 30 enchantment system. Which is a lot of sugar cane and a lot, a lot, a lot of leather. So that's why I started this. It's called the Pit of Cows or something. I don't know. This is how we um, breed my cows and look, see? They love it. Just breed the cows. See? That a lot. And it also gives you experience points. So, uh, nice tip from a. Uh, oh, look at that. And, event, and you get experience from a killing animals too. So I mean, like it's a perfect, it's perfect. And also, I worked on my sugar, a sugar cane farm, and I got a little carried away. Let me get out of here. And uh, yeah, I surrounded the entire river biome that was here uh, in sugar cane. The entire thing. I have plenty of paper. If, I could, if you would like to see, well, you will have to see if you're watching this. Yeah. That that was from one go. That was that was from one run. Then we have our chicken farm for food. We just throw eggs in, and then I also get random eggs. See, it works pretty well. Then I've been uh, I also added uh, little signs on each of them. This is the farmhouse, as you can tell. That's the and then on the blacksmith, I have finally finished the walls, and I put the little sign for blacksmith. There we go. With I have all my little emeralds and all my stuff in here and all that kind of stuff. Blacksmithery and all this kind of stuff. All in this one house. Then I have a crazy wheat farm over here. And that's pretty much all I found. That's pretty much it. So, um, today I've also gotten done a little bit of work uh, in the nether. I've been using, getting a lot of stuff. And I also decided I wanted to just dig pretty much a straight line. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry that was so dark. Pretty much just a straight line. I just was like digging in the nether because I needed to find a nether fortress. And we made it. And you're probably wondering why there's a nether por portal here. It's because I always believe that you should always build nether portals wherever you want. But I always have a good belief that it, you might find something really cool if you build your nether portal out here. And I was right. Yeah, and also we're going to do a lot of farming today because those cows are very important. Also, uh, the composter, like, it's not u useful for, like, industrial amounts of, like, sure, bone, bone meal, but I found out that it's actually incredibly useful for, like, industrial amounts of, uh, what was it? Just really just useful for, uh, just, uh, getting rid of these seeds. And also, um, the seeds are incredibly useful for breeding these chickens up. I know it kind of seems counterintuitive, but if you just keep clicking in there and shift clicking, shift like this, uh, you not only get experience points, but you get more eggs coming out of this. So it's... I'm just going to keep throwing the eggs in there, and I think that's good. And that's pretty much how you get. I'm getting experience, mostly from peaceful methods. Mining and such and so forth. Let me get all the sugar cane. All those seeds, and I'll put the bone meal in here. Now, I actually have now have a st two stacks of uh, almost three stacks of wheat, which we'll be using to breed lots of cows. Because cows are very fun to breed. Fun, if you will. Oh, God, there's so many. Flip. Go, 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 go. 
We're just breeding up all these cows and throwing weed at their faces. Throw the weed. Throw the weed. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, the wheat is everywhere. Come on, breed the cows. I mean, like, look at this. Man. Okay, we bred the cows up. Alright, so now that the... So yeah, this is our... My, my, um, I intend to fill this entire block up with, like, hundreds of cows. So, before I kill them. Also, this is, like, my main supply of food because of how efficient... How much... It's just so easy. So, uh, over here, we're going to be building our lumber hut. And I'm thinking, for the design of it, I want to build, like, a kind of, like, kind of my, not storage area, but I'm thinking a good, I, I don't know how I would like to build it. I'm also going to get rid of these beds and put them in a chest, actually. Oh. I've actually been starting to store things in, like, correct spots, like, the blacksmith holds stones and stuff like that. The, uh, yeah, that, the blacksmithery holds, like, Gems and such, diamonds, and quartz, more gems, not seeds, but uh, it holds ev everything like loot based. Oh wait, that's not supposed to be in there. Wrong, wrong. But everything really um dungeon based and like loot based, like all those kinds of deals. That all goes in here. Ugh, come on, stop it. Like so, and so on, so forth. Right, that's pretty much what these are for. But everything else I don't have a spot for yet, which kind of sucks. It's kind of frustrating. But it's doing better, I would say. Also, I added a quartz floor on this because I thought it looked really nice. It looked much better than, uh, well, it looks better than just the dirt floor I had. I think I'm going to need to put, like, specific flooring. I th Oh, wait. Actually, you know what? While, we're in the mo while I'm in the mindset, I think I will put the flooring of this place in. I think we're gonna- I'm gonna go with dirt- I am not a dirt floor, because this is just disgusting. We're gonna go with a, um, plank floor, obviously, because planks are really useful. I still need to make those windows. I am so not doing well. There we are! All fixed up. There we go. Oh, it's time to sleep. Also, you can tell I've already killed some of the cows. We're gonna get lots of cow heads, that's the best part about this. Sugar came from. We need to find a village pretty soon, I would say, so we can, like, um, sell all this stuff to the villagers, because there's so much of this. Also, I have a compass. I think that leads to, like, the universal spawn, not, like, my spawn. Yeah, it's not pointing that way, so I'm gonna say the village is that way. The village is this way, guys. Alright, guys, we made it through the desert of the dead. And we made it to the Minecraft village. Probably all the villagers are dead, but that's beside the point. We're definitely gonna kidnap if there are any left. Well, guys, the entire village is dead. Well, guys, I guess we'll end this episode with a quick time lapse of me breeding cows and then the end. The end of Cowdom. <laughs> well, I gotta get this all this done. Mm. Stupid. But, uh, I'm gonna just keep talking. Alright, guys. Well, I'm gonna just keep talking to a cow time lapse. I don't even know what I'm doing.
Oh god, so many cows. So much animal, so many animals. We got uh, a couple cows. This is what the screen should, this is gonna be the, uh, this is just gonna be the, uh, main, main, this is gonna be the main screen. It's gonna be our, uh, this, uh, this is, this is insanity. Look at this. Look at that. Look how many freaking cows there are. <sighs> Oh, look, I'm gonna, I can't kill them on camera because that would take too long. But everyone, I hope you enjoyed this quick, this fun episode of whatever craft this is gonna be, whatever this is gonna be called. That was a demon sound, but hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, if you, uh, like it if you did like it, and if you really liked it, please click that little subscribe button. It really helps the channel, and thank you so much everyone for watching, and goodbye.